Hello friends, I am Gaurav from Android Programming. In this video we are learn data storage in Android. Uh, in shared preferences you can store all primitive data type in key value pair. And second it is internal storage. Internal storage it means it is actual you can store uh, uh, all data in your device memory. And second it is external storage. External storage it means you can uh, uh, you can store all data in your SD card and next is um, SQLite SQLite database it is lightweight database um, provided by in Android and last one is network connection network connection is nothing but you can uh, you can store all your data in uh, in your server depending on your requirement and your app need you can choose anyone but most uh, most of the time we, we are using uh, share preferences so in this video video i will uh, show you one example uh, all of share preferences with the help of sh share preferences we are store uh, some data so let's start this is my android studio uh, basically i i was already create one ui here uh, it is basic ui just like here it is email id field and password field are available and uh, second it is login so what i i will what i will do here when user click on login button so that time i will store email id and password in share preferences so first of all for well, this is my id btn login and this is my button id so i will write code here first first of all I will declare one uh, button here private button uh, login login btn and I will assign one uh, I will set value to login login btn is equal to find view by id here r dot id dot r dot id dot um, btn login so here btn login and i need this to typecast in button and also I need to edit text here to accept user value value from user it is edit text first it is edit email second second one is edit password for email edit email is equals to find view by id r dot id dot what is edit email edit email and i need to typecast this okay my id and variable name is same so i need to change this m edit I'll make it edit and here ID. Hmm. Oh, ID dot. Well, and I need to type cost this and next is my edit password edit password it's equals find you by id r dot id edit password 
so edt password and i am typecast this to edit text and i will set one click listener for login button login button dot set set on click listener here new on click listener and i am right to before uh, doing any code in on click listener i'm right to uh, one of um, uh, two method basically here first it is save data in share preferences and second one it is uh, fetch data from share preferences so here this is my code <coughs> first it is uh, uh, save data in save data first time create one instance for uh, sh uh, share preferences uh, share preferences editor editor is equal equals get share preferences says in get share preference method you need to ass uh, assign to value first it is file name and second it is mode Mo uh, what is file name file name it means you, you can store my uh, data in multiple files so here I am I'm using login info file name this is my file name login info and mode it is pri uh, private you, you, uh, you can you can always set mode private and second it is uh, editor dot put string because email id i will give uh, set data for email id it's string and also password is also set in string format but it is uh, next one is editor dot put in with the help of put in you can uh, save data in integer format so there is uh, all primitive all kinds of primitive data types are supported here so which will you need as per your requirement so you can set here put in just like i will give you one more example here here editor dot put you can use put float or put long or string set anything okay. okay and last it is uh, editor dot commit this is your last line uh, so the, uh, this is my save code and get uh, and get data okay so get data you need uh, so share preferences object share preferences preferences equals to get, uh, get preferences here it is file name and mode private and here i am will, will give first it is email id preferences dot get string with the help of get, get string you can get um, uh, string and you need to pass key here it is key is my email id and value is str email which will be i will pass my method and here it is get string it is key it's email and default value is null and second it is get string password default value null and third one last is user id and default value is zero so i am right i will call this method in my on click so save data and I need to pass the two string here first it is email id email id it is edt email email dot get text dot to string and second it is password password is edt password dot get text dot to string so with the help of this method I will store email id and password in my share preferences so before um, after that uh, once we are stored this i will call get data method so in get data method there is two strings are written here no oh, sorry basically two two string and one int integer value it will return this method so i can so um, add one log file here so 
so with the help of log file you can easily uh, see what uh, what is our output uh, of this method and here it is email and next one is same thing for here password so write here password and last one is user id so friend so this is uh, with the help of this code you can store data in shared preferences and you can easily get data from shared preferences so thanks for watching my video i hope you will learn lots of things here i hope you learn lots of things so please do like and subscribe my channel thanks for